Denport fire recruits got the chance to practice skills they'll need on the job. News H Jenna Webster now shows us the all too real training they got in the heat of today. A live fire exercise was a training for six new firefighters. We like to try to get them baptized in the fire, if you will. Firefighters spend eight weeks in the academy before the last step of their training, the live fire. But I just want to make sure everybody's good and comfortable, not well, comfortable to lose the Leading the training today is Brian Moore. He says usually this part is done in a special training building with a gas fire. It's not unique where these houses are. But today. It's kind of like learning how to swim. The first time you go in, it's a little, uh, a little frightening. And so by giving the uh, uh, new candidates an actual live fire to experience, so it's not the first time that they see it is when they're actually on shift. They got to experience going into a real house that was donated by the First Baptist Church. The largest danger is the unknown. Smaller fires were set in different rooms of the house and the new recruits took turns acting as officer, where their job is to assess the building from the outside before leading everyone in to attack. Take a look at the building and see what the structure uh, tells it before they actually get in where they can't see. There's little telltale signs by looking at windows and doors. I think they did real well. I was real happy. And at the end, All right, we're just let it go now. giving the new firefighters the invaluable experience that they can only get from this unique training. In Davenport, Jenna Webster, WQAD News 8. The church that donated the house is planning to add picnic tables to what's now an empty lot. Hopefully local kids and neighbors will be able to use it in the future.